state two ways in which the introduction of Christianity undermined African culture in Kenya. Reasons why Christian missionaries established mission stations in Kenya during the pre-colonial period included Mission stations were established by Christian missionaries to serve as centers for converting Africans, to serve as centers where Africans would be taught basic literacy to enable them to read the Bible, to teach Africans new methods of carpentry, farming, and masonry, or to train African catechists who would in turn facilitate the spread of Christianity. Five, to use them as centers for the spread of Western European culture. Six, to serve as health centers where basic health care was provided to Africans. To serve as settlement for freed slaves and other displaced people. To serve as base where European missionaries could operate from. Factors that undermined Christian missionaries' activities in Kenya during the 19th century. Hostility by believers of traditional religion who saw missionaries as a threat to their beliefs and cultural practices. Number two, opposition by leaders of Islamic faith and other believers whose interests were to advance their religion in the region. Three, harsh tropical climate coupled up with tropical diseases, for example, malaria. Four, inadequate funds and supplies such as food. Five, inadequate personnel to carry out missionary activities. Six, rivalry among different Christian groups. Seven, communication barrier, that is, Lack of common language of communication to facilitate interaction with land conversions of Africa. 8. Strict Christian doctrine which were incompatible with traditional beliefs and practices. 9. Limited transport and communication facilities. 10. Vastness of areas covered by individual missionaries. We we'll proceed to the next question. <laughs>